the North Cape? Yes. Do I need to say that? <coughs> this is a North Cape uh, burn pan. We're just going to show basically how the entire system is installed from the main burner orifice to the flex connector all the way up to the propane line. So what you have is the uh, unit comes with a orifice. Propane orifice has ventilated holes on the side with the fitting already attached to it. You're going to screw this onto the burner pan. You're going to take a wrench then to secure this down and snug it on tight. Once that is secured into place, you're going to take your flex connector. It screws on here. I'm going to use a couple different wrenches for this one so you can hold this in place and secure the flex connector. You'll notice that we did not put any tape on the flex connector because it's a flared fitting does not require tape. This then goes to the key valve. The key valve already has a fitting installed inside of it. So we're going to flex connector is going to be installed to this. We're going to take our wrenches again and we're going to snug these down. Secure those tight. Then you're going to take another fitting, screws in the end of the other side of the key valve here. This has a 3 8 fitting on it. You're going to take your wrenches, secure these into place. Make sure they're tight. Next step, you're going to take your LP regulator hose. Has a 3 8 fitting on the one end. You're going to screw it into here. Again, there's no tape on this because it's a flared fitting. So we're going to secure this into place with our wrenches. The other end is going to screw to your tank and you're done.